So yep. we're going into church. Yep. Maddie decided to wear tennis shoes today instead of her nice, pretty, fancy boots. Oh well. I saw. Do you like that? Look at that. So we are home from church. We just got through with some leftover spaghetti. And the boys and dad are outside. They're getting up some leaves from the yard. And Jimmy is preparing his truck for his work day tomorrow. And I am getting ready to go sit down and do some editing. So that is what we are doing this Sunday afternoon. Um, yeah, so we have tons. Some of you guys have asked why we rake up our leaves. Our leaves are excessive <laughs> completely excessive like there is so so many leaves if we did not get the leaves up we would have issues with snakes and um, things like that so we have to get them up it's just really also it's just so like the kids track them in the house and it makes a big mess so the guys are i don't know what they're doing with that lawnmower they probably shouldn't be doing that. Let me yell at them for a sec. Yeah. So I had to tell the boys not to use the lawnmower to mulch up all the leaves outside. They had them piled up and using my lawnmower to do it. And I just knew that it would ruin the lawnmower. I don't know what Mason's doing. He's running around like a crazy boy in his church clothes. All those black bags out there are leaves. And then... See if we can get a good look at the boys. What are you doing? Don't run through here in your shoes, boy. Sorry. What are you doing? No, I'm gonna go there. What's that boy doing? <laughs> I guess Maddie's helping it uh, two handfuls at a time. Look at those good helpers. <laughs> they're so cute so I'm gonna take this time since I'm in the house and it's quiet alone to make myself a nice hot cup of tea and sit down peace and quiet maybe I will read or edit or crochet or do something nice and peaceful but Honestly, for the rest of the day, I want to spend it relaxing. I told Jimmy that that was my plan for today. I definitely wanted to take a day of rest and just kind of chill and relax. I just wrapped a present. I have a few presents wrapped already. Woo! <laughs> so, here they are down here. I've got some just little gifts for the little ones that I ordered online. So, I went ahead and wrapped those up. And uh, my hope is to do a couple more online orders coming up pretty soon. So we'll see about that. This time of year is really hard for us. A lot of times because my husband's work slows down a lot during this time of year. And um, inevitably our finances get really, 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 really tight. So... Um, that's just the way it is and there's not a whole lot we can do about it but um, somehow or another God always provides for us during this time of year so I'm not worried in the slightest because he does every single year sometimes not until the very last minute but he always provides so no worries there so anywho I'm gonna go sit down and maybe turn the fireplace on it's pretty chilly today 
and get maybe a little Christmas movie on or something like that. just dropped Alex off with his mother and we're gonna run into Michael's really quick just to take a quick peek at yeah, what they got in here. Go run into three frogs. Sweet frogs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I bought a ten dollar gift card and my sweet frog gift card. Oh, Mason oh, got a gift card. My Your name? Come on. <laughs> All right, let's see. Mason's got. Oh, that looks good. I got strawberry banana. Okay, let me see your coat. I got strawberry and banana. You got strawberry and what? Vanilla? Yeah. Thank you. You got cotton candy. You loaded up like a whole month. I know. And I, and I got banana. You got vanilla, and Daddy got his usual. Strawberry. And I, and I got strawberry. And mommy didn't get any today because mommy is very full and I did not need any ice cream. So Mason's gonna have a belly ache tonight. I oh, am. <laughs> he said I am. I'm not gonna have a belly ache. Huh? I'm not gonna have a belly ache. I will gladly. <laughs> You're gonna have a belly ache. I hope not. <laughs> but now I'm not. This is our little preacher right here. Yeah, he's our preacher. Mason's been preaching to the boys and aren't you? Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure Mason's going to be a pastor when he grows up. <laughs> You've been preaching about the real meaning of Christmas, haven't you? Yep. And how everything comes from who? God. That's right. Look at Maddie's little boo-boo on her eye. She did that with her coat, didn't you? Yeah. How's hurts. that ice cream? Good. Or frozen yogurt? I don't know where she got that from. The bruise. Where? Oh, uh, uh, right there. I don't know where she got that from. Yeah, oh yeah. She got it from her coat zipper, I think. It scratched her. Yeah, I got it from my coat. You did? Oh. Look at that one right there. It's all decorated. Look There's the over there. garland. Look at the mix. Yeah. And there's a big snowman. Are you ready to read the Elvis book? And a Christmas tree. Are you ready to read the Elvis book tonight? Yeah. So tell everybody what we're going to try to do. And two Yep. Tell everybody what we're going to try to do tonight. Uh, read the Elvis book and hopefully Elvis comes. And Elvis is who? Uh, our elf. Elvis is he our elf. He comes. He's our elf on the shelf. So we're gonna read the book because usually if we read the book, he comes. Because he hasn't made an appearance yet this year. We're gonna see if Elvis will come see us. I think he might be waiting for us to read the book. I just got the books out yesterday. Yeah, maybe I might as well read the book. I bet so. And. He and he was sitting on a chair. Mm-hmm. He likes to do funny things. Sometimes he's hiding real good. Sometimes he don't move because he just, I don't know why. Sometimes he likes to stay in the same spot for two days. Remember when he did that? Stay in the same spot for a couple days? Hey, maybe he'll get alone. Yeah. Maybe if it's real comfortable, he likes to stay in the same spot. But sometimes he goes swimming in marshmallows. <laughs> Remember when you did that? Yeah. I saw on Facebook one of one of somebody's elves pooped out peppermint peppermints in the potty. Oh my lord. <laughs> <laughs> we 
right then. Uh, they're elf pooped out paper bits. Remember last year Elvis wrote um, a message to you on the mirror in the bathroom? Mm -hmm. That was pretty cool. Mm -hmm. That was fun. <laughs> oh, Elvis, he's a funny elf. So when we ran into Michael's, they did not have what I went in there to get. Actually, they did, but it was the wrong thing. Anyway, they did have the thing that we do. This is a tradition of ours every single year. <laughs> So they had these 50% off. So we always get one of these uh, paintable, I don't know what the they're made out of. Like, Mom, Mom, um, you know, Mom, you know red and green make purple? Actually yeah. made orange. Very nice. Make orange see. Okay, so this is a gingerbread house. And, and I'm making Santa's toy shop. This is Santa's toy shop. And, and then Mom did that one over here and that did train. Yep, so let's see the one Mom did. Yes, or last year. This is the one I did last year. So this is like what we kind of do every year as part of our tradition. So uh, Mason wanted that one. We got this one for Maddie in case she wanted to do it or for me or whatever. So I may just start it and then the boys aren't really into this kind of stuff. So, I may just start one, and then if she wants to finish it, she can. But mm -hmm. she, um, this. Stop. she was having herself a bit of a little meltdown. That one's so hard. Yeah, this one's hard. What's up with that? So, we're letting her calm down a little bit. Dude, mm -hmm. dude, I, it, my, mine, is, mine is so hard. Ooh, nice. Yes. That's going to look good. And I'm probably going to paint this black. Okay. Jump out of bed and come running to see who will be the first to spot little old me. Hello, me. Hello, me. Hello, this. Sit down. They're jumping out of bed to see where the elf went. Maybe the kitchen, the bathroom, or den is where you will find me, your special elf friend. I can hide on a plant, a shelf, or a frame. Where will I be? Let's make it a game. That? Not it. Mm -hmm. And kill them. There's only one rule that you have to follow, so I will be, so I will come back and be here tomorrow. Please do not touch, touch touch me. My magic might go, and Santa won't hear all I've seen or I know. So no touching. No touching the elves, right? Yep, I won't go to tell him that you've said your prayers or helped to bake cookies or cleaned off the stairs. How will he know how good you have been? He might start to think you forgot about him. Who forgot about him? Until then, I wish every girl and each boy a Christmas of peace and a year full of joy. 
The end.